I want to bring to you another miracle. This is, she was, the plaintiff in the Roe v. Wade case. She was, she's known as the Jane Roe of Roe v. Wade, but her name is Norma McCorvey. She came out of the abortion industry in 1995, gave her life to Christ, and she has dedicated her life to overturning the case that bears her name and doing all that she can to build a culture of life and save lives. Please help me welcome Miss Norma McCorvey. <laughs> oh, isn't it a gorgeous day? Getting kind of toast to myself. Um, it's so wonderful to be back in Dallas. I haven't been here in a couple of years. Um, so, hey. Hey. To that I know, and to you, I don't know, hey. Um, so, I, I don't really know to do a song, you know, a song and dance, or uh, to tell you how grateful that I am to see this bigger crowd, Karen. Good grief. I haven't seen this many people in downtown since Spacey's. <laughs> well, anyway, uh, <laughs> um, I, I really don't know where to start. I mean, my life has taken a complete turn. Um, it seems like I get through with one thing and then something else slips in. A little closer. Is that close enough? <laughs> I, 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 I don't know. Every time I turn around, there's something different going on. Um, I, I just... I'm here with a, a couple of friends of mine from London, uh, Peter McKenzie and Mike, his son, and they just did this wonderful film uh, on life uh, called Doombie. Doombie rocks, I'm in it. Uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm Nancy Thurber, I'm the town pro-lifer. Okay, so that didn't go on too well. Anyway, um, I just really don't know what to say. I mean, except that I'm really happy to be here. I'm very grateful for my new life. Um, gosh, it's been what, 15 years? 16 years? 17? Boy. Okay. But nonetheless, um, I mean, praise God. I mean, who would have ever thought a renegade like me could have calmed down? Well, kind of. Um, but I'm grateful for uh, what I've got, and I'm grateful for all my friends and family. Um, I really don't know what else to say, except thank you for coming. Um, it's, it's, a, it, it's, a, it's a shame that we all have to get together like this on this kind of day, um, for this reason. But um, it's a good thing that we all think alike, and actually I think we all go to the same church. So thank you, and God bless, and have a wonderful afternoon. Thank you, Norma. We're so glad. Yes, she is in the movie Doonby, which is coming out in a month. And and then there's another pro-life movie that's coming out as well, October Baby. And that's coming out. They're both coming out February and March. You have to go see them, Doonby and October Baby, and bring your friends to help build a culture of life. Okay, we're just about to have the music that'll send us off. Please be sure to wait until the flags are going first to exit. The flags and the color course so that the police can get everybody in, in line. You are all invited to a pro-life ministry fair at First Baptist in Dallas on the way back. And there's also a reception with cookies and uh, cocoa at the cathedral. I'd also like to say a word of thanks to Concerned Women for America of Texas and Hedinger. Involved Through Life, Downtown Pregnancy Center. Life Chain, Operation Outcry, and our friends who've come up from Austin today, Joe Poyman with Texas for Life, Alliance for Life, Carol Everett with the Heidi Group, and David Walls with Liberty Institute, so that we can all work together to bring this Holocaust to an end. Thank you all so much for coming. Oh, the, that's right. The Christ for the Nations group that are going back with Keith. We need to meet over here by the tree in the corner right over there. So thank you all. Stay engaged each and every day for the victory as we keep on winning until this is over. And we will see you again next year. God bless you. But we don't know where our car is. No, 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 because I think we're all going to walk back to the parking lot together. See you for now.